Morning guys, Dwayne Lulu here again, Spots and Dots, Matrix Shad. So just got off of work, got home, loaded up, and went straight to the boat launch, guys. So I'm gonna go give it a shot, see what's happening. <clears throat> I gotta pick my daughter up again later on, so I won't get a full day of fishing. But anyways, hey, if you haven't subscribed to Spots and Dots yet, hit that subscribe button and We'll see y'all on the water with catching fish, guys. Hopefully, anyways. All right, guys. So before we get into this video, which you're going to want to watch. I'm not going to lie. I want to talk about these lures that I used today. And I want to talk about the fishing conditions I had. So let's get right to it, guys. So this is what I started off with. This is the Matrix Shad Ultraviolet. And you'll see, I'll go out onto a reef out there, and I work that reef for a good while. I end up only catching four fish, but uh, I caught two of them on the ultraviolet. Out on that reef, I caught two of them on the limbo slice, matrix side limbo slice. All right. Then I worked my way up inside the bayou. Once I got up inside the bayou, started throwing this magneto. All right. And I also used everything on a Matrix Black Platinum Jig Head, a 3.8 ounce. Had a good, strong, falling tide. Water temperature was 71 degrees. Wind was blowing a little bit, so that's why I didn't stay out front too long. But anyways, those were the conditions I had. Once I got way back in the bayou, the water clarity was really clear. Up at the front of the bayous, it really wasn't as clean, but when I got way back in there and it cleaned up, and that's where I caught my fish, guys. So, and the key to fishing in the bayous today was being persistent. All right, I made a lot of stops in the bayou today, but I knew what I wanted to target. I knew the areas. It was where bayous met other bayous, like I've said many, many times. All right, so all the drains and empty into all these bayous, and as I said, I stopped at a bunch of different ones they're not going to be in the video but when i get to the right one that's where you're going to see where i'm catching a lot of fish guys so that was the key y'all enjoy this video there you go first fish See what we got, guys. It's like a trout of some kind. Might be a speckled trout. Oh yeah, nice looking trout, guys. Oh, okay, he gone. We just gonna throw him over anyway, so it ain't a big deal. Drop my power pole. See if there's a couple of them here. We can't catch a few. There's at least one. This is a nice healthy trout too. Oh, there's another one. Here we go. Could be on to something, guys. Could be on to something. All right. Matrix Shad Ultraviolet. Getting it done already. Nice trout, guys. Nice trout. Give that. I'm gonna measure him just to measure him, see where he's at. I ain't keeping fish today, but 14 and a half. Fine looking trout, guys. Good deal. Good deal. Let's catch some more down. Alright guys, there's another one. Been working this spot for a while, man. I can't, I don't know what the deal is, but a nice trout switch to the limbo slice is what i did i had one hit a second ago and i just pulled this one in this is a nice looking trout i think this one would definitely be a keeper beautiful trout so i give it a few more tries i just i can't tell you how many times i've casted since i caught that last one hey it's 14 and a half still a nice looking trout guys
There's one. All right. So on that cast, I just made a steady retrieve. Let's see, keep doing that, see if it makes a difference. Ooh, look at this. Nice size white trout right here, guys. Now see, this is what I needed the other night when I went night fishing. <laughs> Some white trout like this. Huh. Anyways, decent white trout. I'm gonna throw him back, let him go. Alright guys, I can't sit out here and wait for this bike to pick up. I'm on a limited time schedule, so I'm gonna push on into the bayous, hit some drains, see what happens guys. Alright guys, got something here. Let's see what we got. It might be a red fish. Oh, it's feeling. Nope. Oh we got. Yep, red fish. Alright. Got us a little red fish here. Okay, I'm spitting up. What's that? Little bitty, them little bitty old minnows. Little, little bitty old minnow he's spitting up. So I caught him. I've been using the Matrix Shad Magnetos, what I've been using here. I'm going to give him a measure. I said I had one more tag the other night on my night fishing, but when I was tagging that fish, I looked and I saw I had one more tag. So, yeah. We'll put a tag in this guy and I'm going to let him go. All right, guys, got our tag in him. I'll let him go. Oh, yeah, he's already ready. Good deal. Good deal. Something right here. We got it's like a trout. Small speckled trout. Let him go. There he goes. Another inshore slam. <laughs> All right, made a little move. Water's a little bit cleaner back here. Let's see. Got Here we go. Here we go. Ooh, white trout. Small white trout. On the magneto. Okay. I knew I felt the hit. Oh, another hit right there. Boom. Another one. Boom. Here we go. I think we found something, guys. I think we found something. That was like three or four hits in a row right there. Speckled trout. Look how dark this trout is compared to some of the other ones I caught today. It's dark on top. This water's cleaner back here. Nice looking trout. Bring him back. Magneto. Capitalize on this, hopefully. 
the way that I got those few hits right there, that was three or four hits in a row. So, oh, 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 good fish, guys. Good fish. All right. What we got here feels like a red fish, but I don't really know. Yeah, that's a red fish. That would have been a nice trout, but not a trout. Take a red fish. I'll get him back. Good deal. Good deal. Right in that corner, guys. Let's keep making that happen. Hopefully, please. Oh! 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 Yeah! Come on! Come on! Here we go. I better get my net ready, huh, guys? Last time I didn't get my net ready, I lost the fish. This is going to be a nice red fish right here, guys. Look at that. Beauty. Beauty. Come on. Woo. Fine fish. Woo. We get this net. Get up. Oh, he keeps wrapping that line all around him. Come here, boy. Dude, gotta get a picture of him, guys. All right, let me get him out of, get the hook out of him, get a picture. All right, guys, we got that picture. This dude was 28 and a half inches. Let's get him back in there and let him go. There he goes. Good deal. What a fish. Got another fish. Feels like a feels like another red fish. I'll take it guys. I'll take it. It wouldn't be a keeper. As you seen, I ain't keeping him anyways. Well, this one might be a keeper. I don't know. He's probably right at 17 or so. But I ain't gonna measure him. I ain't got the time. We'll get him on out of here and try to catch some more. Try to make it fun, guys. Tried to get it. I saw that. Something definitely tried to get it. <clears throat> Let's do that again. It looked like a trout. Express mullet. Just want to 
to see if they would hit it, guys. Try it one more time. Oh, really? All right, guys. Got me a fresh magneto on here. Try to get back on them. See if they're still here. Oh, there's, there's something right there. Yeah. There's something right there. Nice redfish. Oh, GoPro battery just went dead, so I gotta change that out. Let this one go. Get another one. Make another one happen. up on that dude. Look how pretty that is. Wee. Let him go. Nito. Egg Nito. trout we got. I'm talking about a white trout. Let him go. Alright. Oh, there's a hit. Didn't even have time to get set up yet, guys. What we got here? Another trout. Alright. Decent little speck. Let him go. Get on out of him. Hit it. it was coming in with it. I could feel it. I felt him hit it and my line just went slack. So I knew he was coming in with it. That's a small one right here. Small white trout. like another trout. Yep. Another small white trout. Oh, we gotta get these out of here. Can't have that. We gotta get back and catch some of our redfish, dude. Try to get it further back. Yeah. 
still feels like a trout. A little better though. Yeah, that's a nice speck of trout. Nice. further back that time maybe it got out of those white trout zone maybe them speck are a little bit further back I've been checking for fray. Nope, I still, still got my line. I just got my lure. All right, let me change this out. And get back at them. All right, guys. Get that way back out there again. Let's see. Oh, I want to hit. Missed him. Biting at the tail. We gotta get past these white trout guys. I don't know where the redfish went. I haven't caught one in a little bit. Oh yeah, look at that guys, finally, that's a keeper trout, that's definitely at least 15 inches, huh, let's measure him and check, not he's very close, oh yeah, oh, whoa, whoa, yeah, he's right at it, right at it, if I would have pinched, it, if I would have Squeezed him a little bit. He didn't make 15, but definitely a nice trout, guys. Oh no, guys. That sounds like a trout right there. Let's see. Let's see what we got over here. Let's get him. He may have moved over here, guys. That does look small though. But that is, I, I do believe that possibly trout right there. Yep, they hitting it already. Oh! That's a good hit. That was a good hit. Over there chasing them little minnows over there. I knew I kept hearing something over there. Look at that. Nice white trout. Nice white trout. I knew I heard something kept popping over there. Maybe these fish moved a little bit. Let's see. Ooh, that magnet was already tore up. Oh, they hitting it. Boom, 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 boom. Oh, here we go. Here we go. I've been wanting, look, I talked about where'd my redfish go. There you go. Put him in the net just to be safe. There we go. All right. 
Another fine redfish. Alright, there he is, guys. We're gonna let him go. Get him out of here. Well, I'm glad those fish came to the top over here and started popping because kind of gave them away where they were, where they moved to. Hitting it. Oh, another hit. I mean, they moved from that corner to right here. That's just pretty neat right there to me, guys pretty neat I don't think that was quite far enough yep it was <laughs> it was what we got another little redfish there we go definitely found the redfish again another one there he oh good hit a little force on him there we go Another nice trout. Look at it. On the magneto. Get a picture of him. him all right look y'all see this little minnow he just popped out this is what they're chasing today guys these little minnows like this all right so you let this guy go but uh anyways back to this little minnow this is what they chasing out there guys little schools of them and when i first pulled up you had to be, well, when I first pulled up, I, I just started casting and started catching fish. All right, and then a little while went on, after a little while went on, those little minnows, well, them fish coming up to the top and start popping on them minnows. So before long, I figured out that the only time I was catching fish is when the fish were coming up and popping on them minnows, and I would cast towards that area. So that's what I've been doing, and that's what's been catching me these fish. Let's try to get some more. Running out of time. <clears throat> I'm gonna probably leave them biting here before it's over with. Which is a good thing. There we go. All right, white trout. Got him, guys. Another pile of minnows just come through. I could see the trout coming up and hitting them, or maybe even redfish. I think that's a redfish right there. Pile of minnows just come through. You can just see see them coming up to the top and grabbing them. Nice little redfish. Oh yeah, that was pretty cool. Get him back in there.
nice speckled trout. Okay. All right. Let's get him up here. Good deal, guys. He's telling me something. They're hitting it on the run. They're hitting it faster than normal. Get another picture of this one, too. All right, guy. He was 16 inches. Caught a few nice trout, that's for sure. Let's get another one. Get it back over there. Oh, right on the bank. There he is. Right along the bank with that one. There we go. Nice trout. Oh, got him in. Almost didn't get him in, but we got him in. Uh, let him go. I'll keep working on that steady retrieve. It seemed like it brought me a couple of bigger trout, that's for sure. There we go. Another nice little trout. In the water, and let him go. Grow up. Okay. He feels a little better. What we got? What we got? A little red. Okay. There he is. Going back. There's one. Let's see what we got. Speckle trout on the major minnow. Get him off of there and chunk him back. goes and they all just boom 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 unbelievable there we go oh yeah oh yeah nice speckle trout good deal good deal I mean, they just smack in the water right there. Nice back. See the fish. See them flashing on top of the water. <laughs> oh, man. Big ones too. It's big splashes. I had to change my battery and my GoPro it went dead. I was doing that. There were some big splashes out here. Big fish breaking. 
on the minnows. I assume it's big redfish. Yep. Yep, yep, yep. Feels better. Feels better than a trout. Here we go. Nice red. Another one with multiple spots. Four and four. Cool. Cool. Good hit. Must be another red fish. Coming in with it. Oh man, look at that blue tail. Look at that. Lit up. Look at the spots on this guy. Keep getting more and more spots. Cool. There's another one. Redfish. Yep. It even looks like a red fish. Trout, little redfish. He was shaking his head just like a trout. Huh. Alright. Guess I was wrong. Red. Alright, got it. Here we go. Another good red fish. Another good red fish. Which way is he going? Dead soldiers down there, guys. All the magnetos all over the floor. Alright, guys. Another fine red fish. I ain't even measuring. I know he'd be another keeper. But let him go. All 
right. There you are again, guys. Fired back up. It's crazy. Seems like they don't want to hit unless they're up on top. Popping like that now, whereas before, they were hitting all the time. Feels like a good fish. Red fish, maybe? Yeah. Red fish. Look at the spots. Five on one side, four on the other. Oh, that was a good fish right there. Did y'all see that? I need that one to hit. I need that one to hit. There he is. Might be him. Oh yeah! Oh come on baby, talk to me. Oh I think I got him to hit. I wanted him to hit and he hit. Good deal. I knew that was a bigger hit. I knew that was a bigger hit. Alright. Let's get this one in. Come on. Come on in. Pretty fish. Alright guys, got a picture with him. Let's see how big he was. Oh, this one is 25 and a half. 25 and a half. Let's get him back in there and let it go. Good fight. Gotta revive her a little bit. Come on. There you go. All right, guys. I'm gonna call that the last fish of the day. Had an awesome day. Whoo! I didn't think I was gonna find them, but I did. Appreciate y'all watching, guys. This is Dwayne Lulu, Matrix Shad, Spots and Dots. Till next time, we out.